The National Museum of Korea is holding a special exhibition to celebrate 1,100 years since the founding of the Korea dynasty. The museum hoped to display the statue of Wanggon, which belongs to North Korea, but it is still waiting for Pyongyang to land the statue to Seoul. Yoon Jung-min provides a glimpse of what to expect. 2018 marks 1,100 years since the medieval Korean kingdom of Korea was founded. To commemorate the anniversary, the National Museum of Korea is hosting a special exhibition, Korea, the Glory of Korea, from December 1st until March 3rd next year. The exhibition introduces masterpieces and items used in the royal palace as well as pieces of Buddhist art. Founded in 918, Korea prospered on the Korean peninsula until 1392. The dynasty traded with foreign countries and was so well known to foreigners that the roots of the word Korea come from the word Korea. Amid the rapid changing situation in East Asia, Korea lasted as a kingdom for 475 years. To celebrate 1100 years since its foundation, 450 relics from museums and institutions around the world have been brought all the way to Seoul for this exhibition. The exhibition shows the empire's artistic accomplishments through paintings, pottery and sculptures, which were made from the delicate touch of the craftsmen of the time. As Buddhism prospered, Korea left many pieces of religious art, such as the painting of the Amitabha Buddha. It was impressive to witness the technology and culture of Goya. I was proud. It's good that I saw what I'd learned in textbooks right before my eyes. An empty glass case sits right next to the statue of Master Hirang, who was a spiritual mentor of Wang Gun, the founder of Korea. The National Museum originally planned to display the statue of Wang Gun, which belongs to North Korea, but the statue is still in Pyongyang right now. During the first inter-Korean summit, South Korean President Moon Jae-in asked his North Korean counterpart Kim Jong-un to send cultural relics for the exhibition from the North, including the statue. Chairman Kim agreed to cooperate then, but Pyongyang has not sent the relics yet. The museum left the space empty in the hope that the relics can be added sometime during the exhibition. Yoon Jung-min, Arirang News.